Today was nomination day across the country as politicians continue their preparations for election day on Wednesday, November 4th. In Belize City, both major political parties gathered their forces and made their way to the Charles Bartlett High building on Mahogany Street. Uh, it's been going very well. It's been going very well. Uh, I have a good relationship with the residents of Freetown. So it's, it's just about continuing the work uh, and building on what we've started already. Um, so it's, it's been going well. And uh, in terms of uh, the country, uh, uh, what, what has been the feeling like in terms of, uh, I know you launched your manifesto, and uh, what, what, what's uh, the, the country, the mood of the country uh, on your behalf of the PUP? Uh, it's, it's, it's been good, very positive. The campaign has been going well. Obviously, we have three more weeks to go. <laughs> three more weeks to go. Uh, so we have to stay focused, work hard for those three weeks. Uh, but we're feeling very good right now. I think um, people are realizing that yes, they appreciate the infrastructural development, the streets and all that. But too many people are saying that they're not feeling the development. The development is not benefiting them, affecting them in any direct kind of way. And that will be a very telling point in this election because people out there are having a very hard time. Too much unemployment, um, growing poverty despite all the petrochemical money, in other words, it, the transformation hasn't benefited enough people. Um, and I think that will make all the difference in this election. So I'm, I'm fairly confident that the POP will deliver this time. We don't know, okay, the party name is new, but the, the senior members in the party have been in the trenches over 15, going on 20 years personally. So we don't know, okay, in this. And I can assure you, Belize, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Because we not buy vote, we beg for vote. You know it takes humility for beg, right? And what holds us together, what brings us together, that the three H, humility to get at our table, which a lot of people around you know, have that before they go into politics. But we ensure our candidates understand you need to be humble, you need to bring humility to the table. First and foremost, yes. We need you to be an honorable person in your community. So you don't need to wait to get at the house for them to bestow honorable on you. I have already bestowed honorable on all our candidates because they are honorable people in their community. And finally, honesty, which are weapon that the truth. The biggest issues are on the negative side, the fact that Her Majesty's loyal and very venerable opposition does not really appear to be offering much of an alternative. And the biggest issue on the positive side is that people are impressed, pleased with the evidence that's before everyone's eyes as to the progress made and are looking forward to see this progress continue, accelerate, increase.